What up, you guys? It's your girl, Sugar Back, and I'm back with another video. How y'all doing today? <clears throat> Excuse me. Y'all, the struggle is real right now because I am so tired. Y'all, and I even left work two hours early, like, and I'm still tired. You feel me? Anyway. As you can see by the title today, I'm going to be showing you my lotion and body spray collection. Um, minus the items that you've already seen in the other video. Um, if you have not seen that video, go back and watch it. It's called My Mall Haul Slash My Mall Slash Victoria's Secret Haul. Look back. Look at that um, video. And I actually found, um, posted that, I want to say last Sunday, so yeah, check that out, um, yeah, check that out, if you want to see those, but anyway, before we get into this video, if you're new here, welcome, welcome, become an official Sugar Bear by hitting the subscribe button, hit the notification bell as well, so you know when I post a video, and why would you want to do that, because it's beautiful over here, and that's just it, y'all. We had 35 sugar bears right now. Come be number 36. Come, come. Come, come to the light. <laughs> Alright. So let's get into this. Alright. Um, and granted, side note, some of these I have not used in so long. Some of them are just really old. And some of them I just kind of discarded. So they just been sitting on my dresser. <clears throat> with the rest of them. Alright, so we're going to start with this one. I think what I'm going to do is show you all my body sprays first and then show you all my lotions. Yeah, so this one I got from, I want to say Burlington Coat Factory. Well, it's Burlington Stores now, but yeah. This one is called Be Sexy NYC. And as far as price points, I don't know. I'm not going to link those in the description this time, but yeah. You can just look them up or yeah. Alright, so this one's called Be Sexy NYC. And I got this from Burlington Coat Factory. Um, and I just like, when I go there, I be seeing random body sprays and stuff, so. And some of it, like, this one is off-brand, but it'll be smelling good, though, so, don't knock, don't knock the off-brand stuff, and I'm stuttering and all that, because I'm trying to be fast, because I want to get this video out, and it's, like, after three already. I laid in the bed way too long, y'all. <coughs> but, I think I deserve it, because I worked, and I was tired. But, I do have somewhere to be, so... And it's not urgent, but I'm going to go eat something. So, like, yeah. Anyway, let's move on to the next one. This one I definitely have not worn, but, like, once or twice. It's called Magic Love, and I got this from Burlington as well. It's inspired by Michael Kors Night Night. called Magic Love Sexy, Sexy Night. Now this one, if I could be honest, is a little strong. Yeah, ooh, yeah, it's a little strong. It's supposed to be inspired by Michael Kors, um, Midnight, but to be honest, if, um, it kind of smells like, um, it's a Chanel perfume I had. I think I still have it. It's a Oh, which reminds me, I have a backpack there with stuff in it. <clears throat> but yeah, it's a Chanel perfume that I have that I don't wear because it's loud. And I don't really like loud things. I like body sprays that smell fruity and stuff like that. So don't ask me why I picked that up because this did not smell fruity at all. <clears throat> but I picked it up, I guess because at the time it did kind of smell good. And then it's like buyer's remorse. Yeah. 
So that's that one. Um, oh, this one. This one I have not worn in a long time, but it's not, it does smell good though. And it's called Our Moment by One Direction. And I wanted to say this was the knockoff, but it's not. I thought it was, but it's not. This is the Body Spray by One Direction. I got this one five below, y'all, for five dollars. And I'm telling y'all, it smells so good. Like, I barely wear it, but when I do, the smell be lingering in the air. I just be more into my um, Bath and Body Works body sprays and things like that. But I will be wearing this. I just can let you can see it again. Our moment. Yeah, I got this from Five Below for five dollars. So yeah, smells really good. And I wanted the the perfume, but um, that joint was like so be like sold out all the time. So maybe not now, but like. I was like, I'll just take the body spray because they smell the same. So, yeah. Let's move on. And you guys, I'm sorry I'm not energetic. But, like, I really am trying. I promise. And just that. Assess to be tired. Assess to be tired. Alright. So, let's move on. This one... Ooh, I can't remember where I got this from. I want to say I got it from Five Below as well, but don't quote me. Yeah, don't quote me because I don't remember. So this one is called Romantic Secret, and I don't wear this. For the simple fact that it don't smell all that... Well, it smells good, but it just don't last. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it smells good, but it, ooh, it just don't last. It's like one of those body sprays that you get that you spray it on yourself, and then, like, five minutes later, the scent is gone. But it smells really good, though. Oh, I know where I got this from. I got this from Roses. That's where I got this from. Romantic Secrets. And it's got like a mix of, mm, it's hard to explain, but it smells really good, y'all. Like, really, really good. I don't spray it on my wrist. Oh, and I want to share a little backstory with y'all, too, because... <clears throat> I believe I made an Instagram post about this at the time of my discovery, but I had, um, or I had, because I would use that all. I had the, um, Sweet Light Candy by, um, Ariana Grande. That smells just like, um, crap. See, never mind, because now I don't even remember. But that, it was that one and like two other body sprays I had that smelled just the same. It was crazy. And I guess, you know, that's why they call it dupes. But yeah, them drinks smell exactly alike. And I was like, <clears throat> living for it. But I got that sweet like candy for Christmas. So, anyway. Moving on. Let's go to Rose Rush. And this is by Paris Hilton. I got this from Burlington. No, I almost say Burlington Co Factory, but I didn't. I got this from Gage. Some of you may not be familiar with that um, store because I don't think they like all over the place. Um, maybe they are, but I don't think so. But anyway, yeah, they be having all the. Um, body sprays and perfumes and stuff, they got clothes, they got toys, handbags, um, they're kind of like a mini, they're kind of like big lot, <clears throat> kind of like big lots, if you know what that is, alright, so this is Rose Rush by Paris Hilton, I bought myself a, bu a bunch of body sprays, 
<laughs> a bunch of body sprays for Christmas. And this was one of them. Um, <clears throat> the other one that I got, I'm about to show y'all. Um, what if I, what is it? The Can Can by Paracota. This is my shit right here. Nobody sells this like that. They sold it at Burlington Store, but I have not seen it in there in a while. Like, so when I seen this at um, Gabe, I bought two of them. One of them I keep in my purse, and that's one just been chilling on my dresser. And I have used the one in my purse, so. Oh, which reminds me. I have... I know I was going to get it. I don't feel like going to get it, though. I'm going to be honest, So My purse is all the way in the kitchen. Yeah. Anyway. So, yeah. Rosé Rush... And Can Can, this Can Can actually had a perfume with it. Not like, they're sold separately, but the Can Can has a perfume too. But I like the body spray. The Can Can perfume is kind of expensive. But the body spray, not so much. What is that? But yeah, I still got the little tag on it. But anyway, moving on. When I'm out of room. Ooh. Okay. And the rose I rush smells so good. It smells like roses. And me usually I don't even like rose smells like that, but that smells okay, you know. Alright, so let's move on. Um, alright, let's go with this one. Endless weekend. I got this from Bath and Body Works. Um, they don't actually sell this no more. They, but when they first came out, they had a perfume, the body spray, and the lotion. I have the lotion too, um, in which I'm going to show you all in a second when I show you all the lotion. But they don't sell this no more, and I'm so mad because this smells so good, y'all, like, and it lasts all day long. Um... But yeah, I actually caught this in the lotion on um, the semi-annual sale. The last time they had it, which was in January, that's when I caught this on the website. Um, and it was pretty, well, not pretty cheap, but it was cheap enough, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, it was, um, that drink smells so flipping right, y'all. I had the perfume at one time, like when it first came out. But it was like a little bottle, and I used that perfume up so fast. I'm telling y'all, because it smells so good. So yeah, Endless Weekend from Bath and Body Works. Alright, so, let's see. Alright, next one. We got Love Spell by Victoria's Secret. And y'all, if y'all watched the, one of the videos I posted um, this past week, you like I said, Love Spell, you would know, Love Spell was my, my junk back in the day, like, I used to, this was the only, um, body spray I would wear from that, um, back of body work. Oh, have mercy, I cannot talk today. This is the only person, um, body spray. <sighs> Alright, this is the only body spray I would ever wear, um, from Victoria's Secret. Like, ever. <clears throat> but, um, I've actually, you know, spaced out, ventured out into other scents, and I think I have it up here. No, I don't. I don't, I believe I had that body spray, too. Maybe not. Maybe it was just lotion. Child, I told me. Anyway, I'm getting off. I'm... My mind is going, <laughs> okay? Um, but yeah, so, oh, I know that too. I got another, um, back story. So, I don't know if you guys, um, know anything about body college, but they've got a body spray called, um, Cherry Something. I 
cannot remember the name of it, but I had it and I used it all. It smells just like lifestyle, like for real, no, no lie at all. I wish I still had the bottle to show you guys, but I don't have it because I used that all. But yep, it smells just like that. Okay, but anyway, yeah, lifestyle. This was man. I used to go to Victoria's Secret every week or every other week and get love spell. This was my junk. And that's when I used to work at um, the children's place at the mall up here by my house. And I'm telling y'all, man, when I worked at that mall, it was bad for business. Because I was always shopping. Like, I'd get off of work, go to Victoria's Secret. Or like how when I worked at Disney Store, I used to go to Aeropostale all the time. Like every time I got paid, I go to Aeropostale. Cause they be having a bomb sales, y'all. Like for real. That's cause it's an outlet mall. But anyway, moving on. I've got pink watermelon. I bought this when I bought the um the endless weekend. So yeah, I bought this when I bought the Endless Weekend. I didn't know what this smelled like at first, but I was like, I'm going to try it out. And if I knew, wait, I did, never mind. Yeah, so this is Pink Watermelon. I bought this um, when they had the semi-annual sale. And the thing I like about Bath & Body Works is they don't test on animals, okay? Animal cruelty is a real thing, like, I hate... I hate stuff like that. I'm such an animal lover. Like, I watch the AS, ASPCA commercial, and I just want to cry because I be like, these poor animals do not deserve the, the treatment they be, they be getting when they out here like this. Like, before they get rescued, they be going through some stuff. I'm telling y'all. And it's very, very terrible. I told my mom one day, I said, I wish I could um, adopt all the pets in the world. <laughs> That's how much of an animal lover I am. Like, I wish I could adopt all the pets in the world. But that was like off topic. I just, yeah, that's what I thought about just now when I said not animal tested. Alright, so moving on, we got Velvet Sugar, and as y'all can see, this one's almost gone, but I've had this for some years now, because I don't even think they sell this no more, um, but I got this from Bath & Body Works as well, um, but yeah, I, this been sitting on my dresser for a hot little minute, I'm telling y'all, and just like, I forgot all about it, because I buy new stuff, and I just be you know, on to that, and I forget about the stuff I already had, so yeah, it's not that it don't smell good, because look at the bottle, it's almost gone, it's just, I forgot about it, I hit the, I hit the, um, laptop, sorry y'all, alright, so let's move on, this is called Golden Hour, and it's by Aeropostale. I got this from Walmart. And it's a body mask. I have one that is called Peach and Daisy. Um, but like I said, that's in my purse. And I don't feel like going to get it. So yeah. This one. And who knew Aeropostale had body masks at the darn Walmart? I knew they sold perfume. But I did not know they had body mess. So when I seen this, I was like, Air Pastel? I'll put it in the air. I'm telling y'all, smell of vision needs to be real. It needs to be real. <laughs> Alright, so let's move on. This one. It's called Picnic Breeze. I got this from Walmart as well. It's by Bodycology. 
this one, I don't know why I even bought this because it do not smell that great. I guess it was more like, ooh, they got a new scent. Because I had looked on their website and they said this was new. So I was looking for it. The one drink that I like from them, though, the most is the coconut hibiscus. That coconut hibiscus, oh my god, mm. smells so good, and it, you can smell it all day long on your face. Do I have it? Oh, I do. All right, so I'll show you all that next. Cause I think that's the last body mess anyway. But yeah, this one smells like water, if that makes sense. I know water don't have a smell, but if water did have a smell, this is what it would smell like. Cause as y'all can see, I've only sprayed it like once or twice. I have not used it. The disappointments. I don't know why I thought this smelled good when I first saw it in the store. That it smells like water, if water would have a scent. <laughs> anyway, let's move on. This is the last body mist. And like I said, like I was just telling you about the coconut hibiscus, see this? It's almost gone, y'all. And I think I might use this today. I need to buy some more. And this says it's got the sweet coconut and blooming hibiscus scent. And it's a fragrance mist by Bodycology. Got this from, I think I already said this, but I got this from Walmart. And this joint smells so good. It says it's an exotic and enticing combination of sweet coconut and blooming hibiscus. This joint right here was the best find. Like one of the best finds at Walmart. This coconut, when I buy this, it goes so fast. I need to start buying two, two bottles. What I should do is just buy it online instead of trying to find it in the store. Cause it'd be hard to find. It's just like when they come out with new scents. I'm not, mm. When they come out with new scents, sometimes the older um, ones aren't that easy to find. So yeah, I'll just buy it online on the Walmart website and have them send it to me. But this drink smells so good, y'all. I'm telling y'all. Somebody invent smell of vision. Because I would love for y'all to smell this. If you do not know about it, go to your local Walmart and buy this. I'm telling you. You will not be disappointed. Because I just put y'all on to something. And it's not expensive either. So, yeah. Look, the bottle's almost gone. I'm telling y'all. No cap. Alright. So, let's move on to the lotions. And I got more body sprays than body lotions. That's what's saying. But that's because I I buy like a separate type of lotion. Actually, right now I wear the Suave lotion, and I think that's coconut scent as well. Um, but yeah, these are just when I buy lotions, it's just to like put them on my hands. I don't really <coughs> I don't really like put them all over my body. Unless, of course, I don't have a choice, I don't have any other lotion to put on, then I'll use it. But I know this too, when you put it all over your body like that, it goes by really fast. That's why I just buy a separate lotion. Okay, but that was another side note. Let's move on to the body lotion. Or body lotion slash hand creams, because... I think, yeah, some of them are hand creams. Alright, so this is the Bombshell by Victoria's Secret. And this is fragrance lotion. So yeah, it's like a body lotion. And I believe they do sell these in a big bottle. A big, big bottle. Yeah, bottle. Y'all. Yeah. This video is becoming a real struggle, and I'm so sorry about it. 
I'm so sorry about it. I'm just trying to, like I said, I'm trying to be quick because I want to get this out to y'all. But I don't want it to be a whole mess either. Yeah. So this is Bombshell by Victoria's Secret. I actually got this for my birthday like three years ago. And I don't, I don't think I ever used it. Oh, it's leaking. It smells good though. It's leaking. I don't know why it's leaking. I guess because, yeah, I don't know. It's kind of watery. I think though, because, like I said, I haven't used it and I've had it for three years. So, I don't know if that's normal or not, but whatever. Let's just keep going. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to move on to Forever Yours. And this is inspired by Calvin Klein's Eternity. Eternity now. Y'all don't mind that. I think that's makeup. Um, where I got this from, I don't know. I want to say I might have got this from Roses. Um, but don't quote me. But yeah, it smells, it's got a soft scent to it. You know what I'm saying? It smells really good. Not like Bath and Body Works good, but it's got like a scent to it, a nice scent to it. Alright, so now we got the Pink Watermelon Body Cream. And I don't think I've even used this yet. Um, I've been more so using the body spray. Uh, my back is hurting. I'm trying to, ooh, I'm trying to get comfortable, y'all. But yeah, my back is hurting. So yeah, like I was saying, I don't think I even used this yet. Or I might have used it to like test it out and then put it back on the dresser. Because that's where I be having all my stuff at. And as a matter of fact, I need to reorganize my dresser. And I think I said that in one of the other videos. <clears throat> yeah, I did. But yeah, this smells so good. Like, yeah, I don't think I even use this. Mm. And this scent. Like I said in one of the other videos, like I said in the Maha, I noticed that with some um, lotions and body sprays, they, um, like they don't, they smell the same, but the body spray might be a stronger scent than the lotion, which I don't know how that happens or why they do it like that, or if they even mean for it to be like that. It just be like that though. Yeah. Alright, so let's move on. We're gonna go into the Endless Weekend. And I think I've used this like once or twice. But it's practically still a whole body. Um, body lotion bottle. I keep pausing y'all because I just cannot get it together. I cannot get it together. But I'm trying, I promise. I'm just so tired. But yeah, so, um, in this weekend, it says on the back, it's got a summer ma mandarin, blue coconut water, and vanilla sandalwood scent. And they like mix them all together. Up in this weekend. They need to bring it back and like bring it back for good because Endless Weekend is like one of the best scents they have ever created. Alright, so moving on, we're gonna go in to, and I've never used this. I've never used this. I know for a fact. We're gonna go into Victoria's Secret's Lifestyle Body Lotion. Fragrance lotion, whatever they is body lotion, y'all. <clears throat> and oh yeah, I didn't read. All right, so it says it's cherry blossom mixed with fresh, fresh peach. So it's cherry blossom mixed with fresh peach. And let me tell y'all, mm -mm -mm. like I said, love smells in my. Oh, I ain't even opened it yet. Yeah, I haven't even opened it, so I didn't use it. 
I have not used it. But it's this is the OG right here. Love spell love spell is the OG because like I said, Victoria's Secret back in the day, this is all I used to wear. Like I did not wear nothing else. Just straight love spell. This is yeah. And when somebody bought this for me for my birthday, I was like, wow, thank you. They bought me this, and they bought me the body mask for my birthday three years ago. So, just a little backstory. I got this, this, and this for my, my birthday three years ago. And this actually... I did have a perfume, and I don't know what happened to it, but it was this and the perfume in the um, package, and I don't know, because I know I didn't use it all, or maybe I didn't, no, I don't think I did, I gotta find it, y'all, I don't know where it is, but yeah, I've never used that lotion, but the body spray, it's like getting halfway, alright, let's move on, Oh, and this one too, I got it for my birthday three years ago. It's called One in a Million. It's 24 hour moisture ultra shea, shea body cream. Now, I've actually got two of these. Somebody bought me two of these for uh, my birthday. Or somebody, like two people bought me the same thing. And, I mean, it smells okay. It's got like an old lady perfume smell to it, if that makes sense. But I've never used either one of these um, lotions. Like I said, I got two of them, so. They just been sitting on my dresser, like, because I've been wearing other stuff. It's crazy. Alright. Oh, and this one, too. Mm, I keep forgetting. It was so much, like, body sprays and lotions I got for my birthday that year. I cannot remember it all. And these was the um, people that um, I worked with that bought, bought me all this. Like, I was not, and I was not expecting a birthday party, like, at all. Like, and when I got a birthday party, I was like, ooh. You know? Well, alright, so here's the thing. I was kind of expecting it, but not really. More like a don't get your hopes up type of deal. They just try and make it like, oh, you ain't getting no birthday party. But this is what they used to do at, um, not the job I just left, but the job before that. They would throw birthday parties for people, like, all the time. I remember one month there was birthday parties, like, every week that whole month it was birthday party and I just was like mmm but see here's the thing when they threw the birthday parties they would ask you like a day or two in advance can you pitch in for it and I never liked that cause I'm like so you gonna ask me the day of or a day before can I pitch in for this birthday party like I don't got bills to pay like, you don't know people's lives. And that's just a side note. You know what I'm saying? I just... Anyway, yeah. So, I got this one as well for my birthday three years ago. And it's called Rose. And this is from Bath and Body Works. I don't know why they bought me this. Because, like I said, I'm not... Well, they didn't even know me in the first place like that. Like, we work together, but we don't really know each other like that. Um, but they bought me this, and it really, truly does smell like roses. And it's a full bottle. Like I said, I don't be wearing stuff that smells like roses. I don't really like stuff like that. I like fruity scents. Like the Love Spell and the um, Endless Weekend and all that. I, this ain't really my deal. But because they bought it for me, I just keep it on my dresser. You know what I'm saying? Um, it says, it's mixed with airy rose water, 
is airy rose water blended with jasmine petals and creamy musk. I don't know what musk is, but I guess it's supposed to smell good. Yeah, no. But I have never used this because, like I said, rose scents is not my. I don't really like it. Alright, and last but not least, we got this one I bought for Christmas. Um, this la last year, I bought this for myself for Christmas. And it's Aeropostale Peach and Daisy Hydrating Body Lotion. Come on, show up. There you go. And, and this is going to be this is going to be a snapshot because this is beautiful. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and do that right now. Oh, I can't because I saw it. Never mind. I forgot. But it's going to be a snapshot, y'all. This is going to be the thumbnail because this, yeah. This is infused with shea butter, uh, fragrance with peach, nectars, and creamy vanilla. And I actually have a candle that goes with it too. The candle, I bought the candle, the body spray, and this lotion. And I believe I've used this already. It won't open. Alright, there you go. Oh no! I've never used it. It's still unopened. But I know it smells good though. Okay? I know it smells good. But yeah, so you guys, this was so beautiful. This was so great, you guys. Even though I struggled a little bit with it, and I kind of like stuttered somewhat. Because I'm trying to be fast, like I said. But I want to, see, it's starting again. <laughs> I want this to be a, a, you know, a good quality video for y'all. So, like, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like I said, the other um, lotions and body sprays I'm not going to show because I've already showed those in a previous video. But if you didn't catch that video, go back and watch it so you can see the other ones that I got. As well as the other items that I bought, got because I got some good stuff, you guys. And it's still in the bag because, like, I have nowhere to put it, so... The body sprays and the lotions more than likely will go in the dresser, but I have to reorganize it, so, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and it's Sunday fun day, so happy Sunday fun day, y'all. Follow me on Instagram, too, because I'll be doing a Sunday fun day post every week, and it's most likely, um... <clears throat> More than likely, always me showing you what I'm eating that day. Or I'll just post, like, something encouraging or a picture or something like that. But I call it my Sunday fun day post. Um, so follow me on Instagram, okay? Because I'm doing my fun Sunday fun day post today um, at the restaurant I'm going to be eating at. Um, so, yeah. And I'm actually going to be going there, like, right after I fi finish filming this. So, yeah, you guys, enjoy your Sunday fun day. I love you guys so very much. Um, also, I should have a video available tomorrow. Um, I have to film it, though. It's going to be uh, my handbag collection. So, if you're in a handbag like me, and I'm telling y'all, I've been like this all my life. Handbags have been handbags have been my thing since I don't know when, but like yeah. So be on the lookout for that video, okay? I love you guys so much. Be safe out here. Check on your loved ones and keep it breezy. I love you. Bye.